Okay, so today we are going to be creating this sunny scene into a rainy scene. So to get things started, I've just got my uh, nice sunny road here and I'm going to use this color lookup and I'm going to click load 3D LUT and um, if you haven't seen the tutorial where I show you how to install LUTs into Photoshop, it's on the screen now. So um, go check that out if you want to import LUTs and also in the description there is a pack of my LUTs. So I'm just going to select the day to night and that instantly will turn it into a lot of a darker scene and if you don't like it that intense you can take the opacity down to maybe 90 but I'm fairly happy with 100. So then we're going to create a new layer and I'm just going to fill it in black like with the fill can um, and then we're going to go up into filter noise and add noise we're going to do 20% and Gaussian so not uniform Gaussian and you can just play around with how much you want but 20% worked for me and then we'll click OK so uh, now we're going to go into filter again going to go into blur motion blur I'm going to go minus 70 and distance wise you can experiment with this this is basically how long your ray is going to be so for this I'm going to go 30 and we can click OK so then I'm going to screen this so you can see now we've got some rain but you can also see that it's got all this color so I'm just going to create a new adjustment layer for black white and I'm going to pin it onto the rain which means that it takes out all the color in it I'm going to create another adjustment layer call this it will be levels we'll pin this on as well and then we'll just play with this to get a better look for our rain so move that into make them a bit stronger and then we'll take down the amount and uh, if we go back to our actual layer you can see at the edges here we're getting quite a lot of um, sort of stuff so we click V to select our transform and we just hold shift while scaling this up we can just scale it out and move it so we don't get any of that and now we have created our rainy scene so it began like this and now it looks stormy and not as pleasant um, and maybe there'd be a rainbow because there's the sun there but I won't show you how to add that today so that's all for this tutorial, see you next week.